Okay, this is, I'm coming back with my reviews on products that I purchased. I'm going right into this so I don't waste any time. But I hope everyone's doing well. It's Wednesday afternoon. So let's get started. This is, these are those Brillo Basics. Pretty good product. Uh, I was using one the other night in a pot that I had that I really need to kind of scrub some stuff out of. And it came out pretty good. So you get 10 in here. So these have been around for a while. Good product. Dollar Tree. I'd say thumbs up for this. Okay, these are the Supreme Tradition. Um, uh, whatever. I can't think of whatever anyway. But uh, really good for seasonings. Seasonings, I'm sorry. This is a 2.5 ounce uh, bottle. I love these. Uh, this is the garlic powder. As you can see, it's all gone. So if you can grab these at the Dollar Tree for a dollar, grab them. A thumbs up on that. Onion powder, supreme tradition, uh, two ounce bottle. It's gone. Really good deal. I love my black olives. Toscani Gardens, large pitted olives, California ripe, grade A. I love, you know, I just love black olives period used to be really crazy about green not so crazy about those anymore so this is a six ounce can and Pompeii also has these uh, olives in the Dollar Tree store but a good brand when we go out Texas Pete original hot salt this is a six ounce bottle they have this at the Golden Corral on the tables it's a good hot sauce my kids joke and say why don't you have Frank's and I'm like Hot sauce to me is hot sauce as long as it's hot. So this bottle is empty. Okay, we got these and all what you've seen so far has come from Dollar Tree. Now this piece right here did not come from the Dollar Tree. This came from Aldi's and it's plain and chocolate. These were like croissants and I did show these to you the other day. They're Loving Fresh is the brand. Uh, ate them already. <laughs> There were like uh, eight rows in here. Excellent. Awesome. Good. So if you see these in the store with this logo on it, purchase. And these were like $2.99. These were $2.99. Okay. Uh, the black tea, Lipton, again, this is a good buy if you see these because they sell out pretty quick. This is the black tea. You get, uh, is it 15 bags in here? Excellent. Excellent. Excellent buy. And then I have the Lipton Green Tea. I got this at Kroger's. This is a 20 bags. The Green Tea Lemon uh, Ginseng. This is good. I mixed this with the tea I made the other day. Oh my God, it was so good. Excellent buy. I got this at Kroger's. I think I paid uh, $2.99 for this. Dollar Tree, a Glad Double Seal bags 22 in a bag you can't beat this you go to a regular grocery store you're not going to pay a dollar for this and for 22 bags i'd say get it so this is definitely a thumbs up definitely a thumbs up okay this is a kroger brand this is bagel shop bagels lenders uh this was the onion it has six slices in here these were 2.99 they were really really good cream cheese on them babies in the morning Excellent, excellent. Thumbs up. This was from the Dollar Tree. This is Brock Gummy Bears uh, made with a real fruit juice. It was good. And I really don't like gummy bears that much, but got them for Jules. She didn't want them, so I ate them. This was one of the clearance items I got that uh, a couple of weeks ago. This is the Lean and Cuisine. This was the Roasted uh, Roasted uh, garlic white bean alfredo this was so good guys and i only paid 79 cents for it i mean it was good so thumbs up i'm gonna be looking for this looking for this because it was good uh kroger's this was uh, a delicious yummy yellow cake mix this was a dollar that's the cake that juliana made that day for the fourth that we had it was really good moist and everything so i would say up for this brand at Kroger's. Of course, Hershey's. Who can go wrong with this? A Dollar Tree brand. It was a dollar. They give you quite a few little nuggets in there. It was good. I like it. Thumbs up. Who doesn't like chocolate? 
Me. Okay, this is for hanging pictures. Um, it is okay. It's like a long nail where you put it in the wall and you just kind of turn it and turn it and turn it. And then it'll like opens in the wall where it catches. It's okay. Would I buy it again? Uh, I don't know. I really don't. I have to think on this one. But I got it from Home Depot. It's called Monkey Hook. And you get two pieces in there. And I can't remember. I think it was like $2 or so that I had to pay for that. This popcorn, which is Simply Truth Organic Popcorn Little Sodium Air Pop. I got that for $0.49. Cents. This was pretty good. It was not bad. Um, would I buy it again if they had it on clearance? Yes. Would I buy it with the original price of like $1.99? I probably would. So I'd give it a half thumbs up. So this was pretty good. And it was a Kroger's brand. Okay, uh, Hanover Brown Sugar Baked Beans 20 ounce can. Dollar Tree brand. Good. I do doctor these up. I do add what I want to add in them. But for this size can at a dollar, I'd say yes. By all means, get that. Uh, here's those peaches I was telling you about. These are good. They're very firm. I love the juice in them. Can't beat it for a dollar. So yes, thumbs up on this one too. Bullseye Everyday Original. Of course. A dollar. Dollar Tree. Yes, of course. Still had a little in there, but you know what? That was good. This rice. And it is the um, Minute White Rice, of course. Who cannot? Of course. A smaller box. This is a 7-ounce box, but definitely a thumbs up. Definitely a thumbs up. And then this a Supreme Tradition Memphis-style barbecue sauce seasoning. Totally excellent. Totally. I would definitely always buy these. Buy these, yes. Okay, there's the Bella uh, Pitted. Firm, plump, and juicy ripe olives, extra large. These are the black. Um, six ounce can. They, I'm telling you, they have the best olives. Okay, this is sim Simply Nature. This was your uh, organic uh, cayenne pepper. Uh, it was a 1.7 ounce bottle. Got it from Kroger's. This is good. I never had used this a lot before. And it gives a spice to your food. So I would say yes. You know what? And actually, I'm going to keep this bottle because I can use this for something else. So, yes, thumbs up for that. Perfect bottle to put uh, seasoning, another type of seasoning in and label it. This uh, Pompeii Instant Season Cubes Chicken. I use this if I do not have chicken stock and it works just as perfect. So, um, you get quite a few little cubes in there. It's a 3.53 ounce uh, container. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And keep that bottle too. Who doesn't love Chester fried bacon cheddar? These are good potato sticks. I love them. I love them. I love them. Thumbs up. And then Hawaiian King uh, dinner rolls. Oh my gosh. These things just by themselves, just by themselves is good. And this was from Kroger's. Uh, this was from Kroger's. This was Dollar Tree. And this was Kroger's. Uh, yes. This hot chocolate, milk chocolate flavor came from, I do believe, the Dollar Tree. It had 10 packs in it. I'm not really a big, big fan of hot chocolate unless it's a really good hot chocolate. So, you know, Juliana likes hot chocolate. So, we get hot chocolate. These, I'm on this row with these biscuit things. This is called Bakehouse. Uh creations this is out of Kroger's I love these biscuits they are so good we generally have them in the morning for breakfast or in the evening and you get uh, I think it's eight you get eight in here so this is a Kroger brand then we have these Johnsonville smoke brat smoke and they're good you can put them under the broiler you can boil them you can fry them breakfast food whatever they are good can't remember the prices on half of this stuff, but I'll just give you the reviews. This is another Kroger brand. It's Buttermilk Complete Pancake and Waffle Mix. I made a big batch of these the other day. Finally used all of it up. Uh, the girls love their pancakes. Easy, easy, easy. Just put the water and you got pancakes. So, good brand. 
All of this I'm giving thumbs up. Just found out about this uh, instant oatmeal. It's Quaker, but this flavor is the Raisin Date and Walnut. Love this. It is so good. I like my oatmeal to have kind of a crunch to it. I can eat it a little easier. So, And you get how many packs in here? It looks like you get, I think it's 10. Yeah, you get 10 in here. So if you see this, this is a good buy. Definitely a thumbs up. And I'm not a big oatmeal person either. But, okay, these were the Blue Corn uh, Simply Truth Organic. These are the ones I got on sale again. They were okay, and I do like Blue Corn, but I don't know. I didn't really, these didn't really move me, but they were okay. And for 49 cents, they were good. I'll give my half thumbs up. Yeah. Okay, here's another one of those dinners. Um, this was the uh, Marie Callender rice and bean bowl, cheesy chipotle. This was $1.19. This was also good too, guys. Uh, I'm going to keep my eye out so if they have any more of these on sale, I catch them because they were a good buy. What is that book in there? Oh, Jesus. Okay, I think that is the end of my haul. Oh, this is the last one. Uh, this was, okay, Olivia, when she comes to stay with me, she likes to put makeup on me. So I let her do it. You know, in the evening when we're, you know, getting ready to, to, to retire, I give her about an hour to play on my face. Would I ever show you guys that? No. It's crazy. But she comes up with all kind of makeup ideas and everything. So I got this 12 color eyeshadow. And it was the Urban. And it was by LA Colors. And really nice colors, guys. Really nice colors. I don't know. Maybe one night I'll... Um, no, I'm not going to tell that lie. I'm not going to... No, I'm not going to do that. But anyway, that is our fun time when we get together and she gets to just be creative with um, the makeup. I think I've shown you everything. Ooh, Libby, I found two pieces of chocolate. I like them. Ooh, no, three. I'll give you one and I'll have one. Yay. Okay, so these were the Hershey Nuggets. I knew I had some the other night. I wanted some chocolate so bad. And I was like, I don't know what I've done with them. I can't find them. Um, Hold on just a second. Okay, this is our dinner tonight, and I had showed you this earlier. So this is the bag that you put the chicken or whatever meat you're going to use. This is what it looks like. I got my chicken drumsticks in here, and it fully coats everything. So I'm going to get ready and put these in the oven and get them cooked up. And at a later time, I'll let you guys know how much, how much, how this tasted. And I actually have some chicken left over. And what I did was I took some zucchini, some onions, some garlic, and uh, cut it up, put it over in the pot, and I'm boiling the rest of the remaining chicken. No, I didn't feel like going through that whole step of showing you today, but I'm sure it's going to be good. And that'll be for a later time because the girls don't like that kind of stuff. But, um, so, I mean, that chicken in that bag, I'm hoping it is really good. I am so hoping... It is really good. Oh, and I found these. Now, you know, what can you say about this? These things are so good. I left my boss, and I didn't do a review with them, but I let her taste one of these, and she said, where did you get that candy from? And I just looked at her, and I said, where do you think? And she says, you and that Dollar Tree. So these, <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm still kind of finding these at a slow time, but um, after Easter, because this is, seems like when these came out was around Easter. But I tell you, this piece of chocolate right now, this this Hershey's chocolate is so good. Uh, our ice machine was not working at work today, so that meant I didn't drink any water today because I like my water kind of cold sometimes. So I'm going to over, overindulge in water tonight, which is good. So guys, you know what? I am going to get off of here. I'm going to get comfortable, enjoy our meal for tonight, enjoy the girls. And it is just hot. I'm, I'm It's it's hot. So I'm trying to not be out in the heat too much. I want to take the girls to the pool because it's just right across the street from where we live. So I'm thinking maybe, maybe Friday or Saturday. We'll see. We'll see how that goes. But with that, guys, I'm going to let you go. I hope you enjoyed this review. If you did, you know, just let me know. And congratulations, pretty and flawed. You, you're moving. Congratulations. I'm so happy for you. I know how it is when you find something you like. So be blessed. Know God loves you. Bye-bye.